Hey, hey, Taylor here on behalf of Viera Consulting. And today I am going to show you how Boost Messenger CRM is going to handle all of your lead generation needs and more. Let's dive in. All right, so I want to start by giving you a glimpse of what your Facebook Messenger inbox is going to look like once you have Boost Messenger CRM installed. So here we are in my gorgeous and organized Facebook Messenger inbox, and you can see my pipeline is organized by these color-coded labels. I'll dive more into these labels a bit later, but you have the option to change them right here. You can assign each person in your pipeline their very own label and their very own tag to specify them even further based on their interests. All right, so how we access the Boost Messenger CRM from Messenger Inbox is by clicking the little logo icon right here. And inside this pop-up, you have multiple features. The first one I wanna show here is that I love this feature. You are able to take notes on your leads. So if one of your leads tells you that they want you to follow up in two weeks, go ahead and take a note on that. Take a note on what their interests are, what, to, what are their pain points. You can put all of that right here. Amazing, this really helps you stand out from the competition. The next thing I wanna show you is canned responses. Again, we'll dive more into this later, but this, these are just DM structures for you to follow, and there are a series of messages that we tend to use again and again, and you can access them right here in Facebook Messenger. Very easy to use. You just click, it populates, and then you send. The third feature I want to show you is the ability to set up follow-up notifications. So like I said earlier, if someone tells you to follow up in two weeks, follow up in two weeks. Go ahead and assign an email, assign a date and a time. You can choose to send this to an autoresponder or to a calendar if you like. Give it a message, follow up in two weeks about proposal, and then you can add that. And you can directly sync this to your Google or iCalendar. The last feature I want to show you is that you can take additional information on each lead, such as the email, phone number, and again, you can send that information using a webhook to another platform. Really cool stuff. All right, so now we are gonna dive more into the Boost Messenger CRM features. We're gonna go through all of these fun features so you can, you can understand why this is going to be massively game-changing for your business. First things first is our labels. You can create as many labels as you want, all right? Follow-up labels, hot leads, medium leads, cold leads, Facebook group labels. The, <laughs> the options are endless, really. Once you have your labels set up, you can always edit the name of them. You can always change the color of them to whatever you like. And additionally, you can just delete them altogether. If you're like, I have no more use for that, no problem. You enter new labels here by giving it a name and pressing add. And that is how labels are created. Next, I wanna bring your attention to tags. Now, tags are really important because this allows us to prioritize our outreach and follow-up efforts. You can use tags for different services. You can use tags for different products. You can also use tags to further specify where your leads are in the buying process. You add them the exact same way as you add labels, and the editing process is also the exact same. Okay, great. Let's hop down to this messages tab. When we click this, as you can see, it's going to open the CRM in a new window and the menu looks a little bit different. But don't worry, I got your back. We're gonna go through all of this. Global templates first. 
this top part here, follow-up, workshop reminder, content follow-up, these are known as global templates, and inside global templates are what we call canned responses. And you can set these up for any kind of DM situation, direct messaging situation you may experience with your leads. Okay, these canned responses are a great way to save time by saving the messages you send again and again. And they're also amazing for guiding your DM conversations for better conversion rates. So literally you can set up global templates for anything from follow-up to market research, trust building questions. You can really build out all of your DM structures right here in Canned Responses and save so much time because you can quickly access these right here inside of Quick Chat and your Facebook Messenger inbox. Friends tab is where you can see all of the people you have labeled at a glance and you can see your numbers here just to get a good idea of what is happening in your CRM. Message segments. This is where, these are the individual parts of messages that you build inside of a message group to then send a broadcast. If it sounds like I'm speaking a foreign language right now, don't worry. <laughs> You'll understand this very soon. But let me just give you a quick glimpse of what a message segment would look like. For example, here's an intro message segment. So we have different variations of messages we set up in this, in this particular segment. Once you have set up multiple message segments, you then group them together. So a message group, for example, might look something like this. It's different message segments grouped together to create one group. And we use these message groups to send out in a broadcast. Broadcast messaging is by far my favorite feature of Boost Messenger CRM. And I'm gonna show you what this does. We go here to create broadcast. We choose a label or a tag. You have both options here. Let's just choose this one. You can choose gender. The time interval is how many minutes in between each message that goes out. And then you choose one of those message groups. So let's say I have a crazy offer going on for my software that I want to go out to my Facebook group. I'm going to choose that message group. I can send this in two minutes or I can schedule it for later. I can limit the number of people for the broadcast. Uh, the other amazing thing is you can auto change the label. You can add new tags or remove tags as these messages are sent out. This is how broadcast works and this is a way for you to send a variation of messages for a specific purpose to people with a, with a certain label or a tag. Absolutely incredible feature. Okay, this download message button allows you to actually download a copy of your DMs so you have them for your records. Now let's hop over to pipelines. If you want to track your sales pipelines, you can put the data here, create a pipeline now, rather than putting it in labels. Eventually, this feature is going to do way more like track sales and numbers, but until that's ready, this is all I'm gonna say about pipelines. <laughs> and if you happen to be using Go High Level CRM, you can also connect that right here in the pipelines area. Let's take a look at APIs. This is obviously where you can, you guessed it, set up different API actions. But as of right now, when this video is being recorded, this is only connected with another automation tool called GroupMonkey. If you happen to be using GroupMonkey, you can connect it here and transfer data from your Facebook group directly into the CRM and assign those group members a group label. All right, and another 
great feature is this one here, Import Export. Let's take a quick look at each of these buttons because they are massively important. So Backup allows you to take a snapshot of all of the data in your CRM, and we do recommend doing this once a week or bi-monthly, and then you have the option here to import it should there ever be an emergency where you're, go you're going to have to use this feature. We don't forecast that, but it is smart to back up your data, and then here is where you would import that data should you ever need to. Export CSV, this allows you to export your CRM data onto another platform, onto another spreadsheet. Export template, I love this feature. This actually allows you to export all of those global templates and canned responses I showed you earlier which is amazing because if you have team members or if you have clients you're trying to help out with, the, with their DMs, you can export that template, share it with them, and they can import it directly onto their CRM. And then they have access to all of your message sequences and DM flows. Here, if you're using Chat Silo, you can import your data from that platform onto ours. You can also export all of your unlabeled friends. And this is really cool because you export this into an Excel sheet, into a Google sheet. Then you can go through and mass label people and then import that same spreadsheet with your friends now labeled. All right, and let's make our way down to settings. Here we are. You definitely want to make sure that your extension is active in Facebook, otherwise you won't see anything, okay? Show labels in quick chat. Yes, I personally love that feature. Let me show you what that looks like. So from the quick chat, we are actually able to label people. Right here, we don't have to be inside of the actual messenger, but we can label them right here in quick chat. If you don't like that for whatever reason, you can disable that right here. Toast notifications in Facebook, I like to turn these off. If you like to, if you like notifications for everything that happens, no problem, keep it on. Okay, lead connector. This is a direct integration of Go High Level. If you have Go High Level, and you want to use Lead Connector, you will have to leave Show Toast Notification in Facebook on, but then you can turn these two off. Okay, that is the only way Lead Connector with Go High Level is going to operate properly. Um, eventually, this glitch will be gone, and you won't have to have this on, but at the time of this recording, if you want to use Lead Connector with Go High Level with our Boost Messenger CRM, go ahead and show Toast Notification in Facebook. Leave this on. All right, and I want to bring your attention just finally to this Notice area here. You can click this area and you will find any sort of emergency updates or updates from the development team that you need to know right away. And of course, this is where you can log out of your tool. So, how excited are we about Boost Messenger CRM? Hey everyone, you have officially seen just about everything Boost Messenger CRM has to offer and now it's your turn to get out there and try it today. Go grow your business on autopilot. Cheers everyone.